the recording. My room is very bright. Okay, there we go, multi-stream. Let me just tilt the monitor a little bit. Get that glare out. Mr. Strauss. Can anybody spare me a bite? Arthur. What do you think of this place, Susan? An improvement on the last, that's for sure. Well, that ain't too hard. My volume's almost maxed out on my headset. Well, I should get back to it. Sure. All right. What do you think of your new home? Let me go now, please. No can do. Hope you choke on it. Whoa, okay. You don't have to be that mean. Uh, settings. Control. Controller. Okay. Definitely vibration on. Third person. First person. Allows tapping action consequence sequence to be easier or even turn it on to hold. What about controller layout? Oh, that's the camera. I, okay, that's camera. Hmm. There's no key binding? Hmm, interesting. Key mapping. On force. Um, eagle eye. No, these are all keyboard and mouse. All right, there doesn't seem to be an easy way of. Hey, what's going on? This is probably my, well, I'm gonna try to attempt to make this my first full walkthrough, playthrough of the game. Last time I just got stuck into act two chapter two and i just did a whole bunch of s side missions and never really did the main missions oh. all right uncle Oh! 
Whoa, whoa. Careful not to work yourself to death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting to try to survive, you get to think all day. Well, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Hey, you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out. Sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses are ready. God, I love this main you character. You gonna take the old man into town? You take us too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> well, can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robin. You're worried about house chores. Let's go. Fair enough. You got me. Come on, then. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment of civilization. <laughs> Ladies are going to love it. Okay, then. Let's go. All right. Out through the trees here, then take a left. Yeah. Out through the trees, take the left. Lumbago. It's very serious. All right, I'll see what's going on. Lumbago, really. You all right there, friend? Oh, hey, you couldn't help me get my other horse back from over there, could you? Sure, no problem. Thanks. It's the white one over there. How was that? Easy. Whoa, now, easy. Good easy. boy. You're a good boy. Now just follow me. Wait. God, if a railroad train was just come and kill me right there and then. Here. Here you go. You're a gentleman, sir. A gentleman. No, not really. I was just trying to impress the women. <laughs> well, anyway, thank you. I mean, we all are trying to impress the women, especially Miss Tilly. Fox no. over there. To Valentine! <laughs> <laughs> You're turning into a regular old fairy godmother there, Arthur. What's that supposed to mean? It means you got a heart. A small one, perhaps, hidden deep inside, but a real one. And you have it, your pulse of old lizard. Lizards have hearts. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. To be honest, if you lot hadn't been here, I probably would have robbed him. <laughs> <laughs> well, you did. <laughs> I got a small heart. Ooh. Size matters. Smell those sheep. I mean, size doesn't <laughs> or matter. Or is that uncle? <laughs> oh, very funny. This looks like a decent little town. Other people. 
Finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. Or to do any real work. She's a society lady now. Okay. Take a good look around, ladies. Let's see what we got here. Go left here, down the main street. Dare's always on the right. Sure you can pick up some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. <laughs> yeah, well, that's a young man's game. <laughs> Ooh, yes. We can get up to some mischief here, all right. Just remember, keep a low profile. Will you remember that, though, Arthur? Probably not. Let's park up down the end there, near the stables. Just like I said, the cultural center of civilization. <laughs> Man at its finest. Uncle, what are we doing? Well, we're going to do what any self-respecting maniac does. Put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble and don't get yourselves noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. Come on, ladies. Imagine we're in Paris. Come on. I imagine Paris and Valentine. So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna ask why. <laughs> you are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. No. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. Very funny. I lied. Ringworm, then rats with the plague, then you. Shut up. This is the place now. Come on. Afternoon. So, what do you need? Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. I you know, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Always thinking ahead, ain't you? You're looking a bit tired there, Arthur. Why don't you pick up some coffee while we're here? Let me know if you have any questions, fellers. Whiskey's oh. on the top shelf, nearest the door. Copy. <laughs> I'm just looking for some whiskey. Uh, you not getting liquor. anything, Arthur? Uh, I, I am. Don't know. Maybe. Uh, uh, ooh, some hair tonic. Make me look like Fabio. So, you're actually buying for once? Okay. You feel all right? See this? Gone. Young folk got no respect for their elders no more. What do you reckon? A lamb or a sausage? Well, this here's a sheep town. The lamb's the best in the state. Now I know what the smell is. <laughs> well, that's a ripe cheese, all right. <coughs> all right. I don't have a pistol, I just have a revolver. I don't think they got any of the special ammo. All done. Thank you kindly. Ah, this should arrows. do the trick. Yep, that's fine whiskey. That should do us. Let's go wait for them outside. Alright, give me a second, bro. You got that, uh, horse stimulant? Any horse testosterone? Make me look buff. Uh, let's go back to the index. That was not what I wanted. Provisions. Assorted salted offals. Yeah, I'm done shopping. 
wanted me to buy some. What was it? Coffee? Oh, there it is. All the best, fellas. Definitely. Thank you, sir. I might come and rob you in the future, but not right now. I'm a good man. Oh, here's to your good health, sir. <laughs> and to being down here off that mountain. Absolutely. It's a funny world, you know. This time in my career, I pictured myself being married to an heiress. Gentlemen, I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house. Acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Denis and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night. As to get to the docks in time for the tides. In some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out there in New Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh, Where's Tilly and Karen? I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? It seemed easy. They have been gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. Oh, there's Tilly over there. That does not look ideal. Excuse me. Get your hands off mm. her, friend. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get off her. <laughs> or what exactly? You want to find out? You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't doing this with you. Go right wait now. with Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. Uncle! Look after her. I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel. The other day, I watched two fellas line up for a duel. Can I help you, sir? Manage. Are you, you sound... Doing... I'm looking for a girl who came in here earlier with a drunk fella. Mid-twenties, blonde. You'd remember her. Yeah, they're in 2B upstairs. Are you, uh, a friend of his? A friend of hers. Earl says the shirt. You sound awfully familiar. No trouble now, please! Well, get the hell out of here, will you? Sorry. Wrong room. <laughs> <laughs> God taking a shit. Hey! Hey, you! A friend of hers. Get out of here, buddy. I pay. Ain't paid a hitter, you goddamn animal. Come here! Uh. Who's talking now? Huh? What the hell are you doing here? Trying to play him. Not very well. You okay? Fine. You sure? Yeah. Nothing. Nothing to worry about. Just men. But stupid bastard. Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. The bank? Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but this is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. Okay. Keep investigating. I will. Nothing in these.
hope uh, everything's okay up there. After you. Thank you, Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? Sure. He only punched me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. Yeah. All right, now. Hey, who's that guy over there looking at us? Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. Impossible. Listen, buddy, come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Come on, get uh, I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, Arthur. Just a word. Yeah. Please, hey, that's my horse. Just following it. You stay away from me. Get back here right now. Oh my God. That's far enough. You stop right here! I just killed an animal, I think. Why are you telling lies about me? No! No! I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now, please help me up. I ain't never been in black water. Then why are you chasing me? I've got an unfortunate face. Yes, yes, me too. Now, please pull me up. Please. I made a mistake. I'm sorry. Let me help right. you up. Come on. Come on. You okay, partner? No. No, I am not. I'm a mess. Well, you ain't dead. There is that. Jimmy Brooks. I think it's best for both of us if we pretend this never happened. Well, I agree. You saved my life. You're a good man, and I, uh, here, you want a pen? It's one of them steel ones. Oh, that's very kind of you. <laughs> but I'm not a good man, Jimmy Brooks. Not usually. You see, I was in Blackwater. <coughs> I killed people. And maybe I should have killed you. Should I have killed you, Jimmy Brooks? Me? I never saw you. Not, not now, not, not never. I think we have an understanding? Of course we do. Jimmy Brooks. <laughs> I will remember that. I've got a good memory. I have... What? I haven't. Not, not one lick. Not one sense in this mind. Come on. Come on. You have a nice day now, sir. Let's go, girl. Anything I can rob from this horse? No. Yep. Yeah. All right. Let's go back to Valentine and drop this horse back because I'm a good man. Oh, wait, wait. There was an animal I killed. Nearby. Some good eating right there, Raven. I don't know if it's good eating. 
Let's move. Here's your horse back, friend. Oh, you really were just borrowing it. Appreciate it. God damn it, I just want to go home. You hey. just kept my raven. You son of a bitch. Whoa. That game, if you're selling, I'm buying. If you want to raise your game here, friend, try placing them bullets real careful. One bullet to the vitals worth a hundred any place else. It's a knack. More you hunt, more you get a sense for it. Let me know how it works. Finest meat here. Nowhere else. Hello. Yeah. Too hot. Hello, mister. Howdy, sir. You know, there's something about this place. Is that right? Anyway, can't put my finger on it. Bye now. <laughs> All right, there we go. Oh, Arthur. Arthur, come here, come here, come over here. I want you to meet our friends. <laughs> oh, pleased to oh. meet you. Well, ain't you just a tough as teak mountain man? Oh, you be quiet, Anastasia. Anyone can tell this one is a pussy cat. Exactly. Yes, he's a pussy cat. Ain't that so, Arthur? Whatever you say. How much you cost, anyway? Well, ain't that a nice way to talk to a lady? Oh, I didn't know I was talking to a lady. Excuse me. Well, nice shop. I must say, you got a fine way with the women, amigo. Yeah, regular dandy and a charm. <laughs> Where's Bill? Oh, man, I dread to think about it. Hey, 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 hey there he is. Watch where you're going. Take it well, easy, Are you about pal. to kiss that guy Take or punch him? Huh? Oh, oh, and we have our answer. Oh, oh. 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 that for? Oh. 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 Big chungus. Okay, oh, this, this guy got me with yeah, the chair in the back. Help me, guys. You 
job, Tommy. Uh, I'm... Yeah, you got him now. Yeah. You won't be All right. Woo. You show them how we do it now time. Yeah. Yeah. Sir, you won the fight already. Surely that's enough. What business is it of yours? <laughs> no business. <clears throat> no business, sir, but please, I beg you. Making new friends again, I see, Arthur. Look who we found sniffing about. Josiah Trelawney. The very same. <laughs> well. I thought you'd gone to New York. And miss all this glamour. You must be joking. How are you? Well, quite well indeed. I went to Blackwater looking for you gentlemen. You're not very popular there, it seems. Ah, Javier and Charles. I've missed you. And Bill looking as well as can be. Gentlemen, always... A pleasure. You're right. We ain't too popular in Blackwater. We left a lot of money there. And young Sean, it seems. Sean, you found him? Yes, I have. He's being held by some bounty hunters, trying to see how much money the government will pay them. I know he's in Blackwater, but there's talk of them moving. Well, if we step foot in Blackwater... Uh, ah. oh. <laughs> Well, then we're dead men for sure. There'll be Pinkertons all over the place, but if he's alive, we gotta try. Yeah, of course. It's you they want, Dutch. Always is. Charles, go find out what you can, carefully. Josiah, take Javier. Arthur, go get yourself cleaned up. Join them when you're ready. Well, what about me? Well, exactly. What about you? What does that mean? Oh, Bill. Come on. I still look like a dirt bag. Good God. Can I get my hat? You arrange the bath, I need a wash. I got someone warming it up for you already. Just head down the corridor there. <laughs> oh, it's, uh, you. Yes, it is. Last time I checked. I, I really don't need any more trouble. I didn't come to make any. I was just protecting a lady. Well, all behind us now, I suppose. So what is it you need? A, a bath, perhaps? Yeah, I paid for a bath. Oh, nope, that's not a bath. The one that says baths is baths. Bath. Oof.
Would you lack any assistance? No. Yeah, I think I'm okay. Thanks. Hmm. All right, I'll leave you to it then. I'm a big boy. I know how to ba bathe myself. Fresh, smelling nice. <laughs> All right, what's the next mission nearby? There's a stranger mission. Oh, I think this, these are the... Uh, Got a Strauss mission, Kieran. Damn. I do not want to run all Trust the way you over there. Folks. Step right up. Waltzing through here like you own the place. But the O'Driscoll's got designs on us. Yeah, how are you making out? Well, this place ain't the biggest shit I've ever seen. Oh, I know. Optional mission, something with the skull on it. The only problem is, I don't see any optional missions nearby, and I am a hell of a long way. I'll probably max out my stamina just running over there. God damn. Oh. All right, I'm out of stamina. Should have stole that guy's horse. God damn it, I'm an idiot. <sighs> Just 
still not nearby. Oh. Hey! Who's there? It's me! Hope you had a good old time while I've been stuck standing here. Break's over, boy. Hey, Jose, just give me a second. Let me. Good evening, Arthur. Good evening. Oh. Good evening. How are you? Covered from that business in the hotel? Oh, yeah. So, we gonna hit that bank I told you about? Let's see. Okay, I'll catch you later then. All right then. This stew is decidedly lacking on decent meat, Mr. Morgan. This should be some real good eating. Well, it's better than nothing, Pearson. Thank you, Arthur. Gentlemen, mind if I warm myself a minute? Ain't so bad here. If I never see snow again, it'll be too soon. Yeah, we'll be all right now. Oh, yeah, there's Reverend Swanson down there. Um, I'll be right back. Oh, man, it's so nice to have a Stream Deck app to... Do all this. All right. Uh... On the run. At my age, I thought I'd be living on some farm somewhere, having some serving girl. Hey. Freshly peeled drink hey. All right, Hosiah. Hey, Arthur. Right Jose, you want to go hunting? What are you hunting? An elephant? <laughs> I wish. No, I saw a huge bear. One of the biggest I ever saw. I reckon nearly a thousand pounds. My God, but you need me to come with you. Of course. Let's go. Where are we heading exactly? Up near the Dakota River. Might take a day or two. I could do with a break from this place. Oh, me too. It's been a rough couple of weeks. You need anything? I don't think so. I got all I need. Let's go then. So you still ain't replaced Bodicea? Nah, I miss her. She was quite a horse. This one's okay, but ain't no Bodicea. I've been meaning to offload this big shire horse for a while now. Unruly bastard. Where'd you get him? Some big loudmouth bastard tried to rob me and was out riding, so I... Well, you know how it is. I see. Let's take him to Valentine. It's on the way, sort of. There's a decent dealer there. We'll unload him. You could buy yourself a new horse. Put your saddle on him. Let's get going. Okay. But well, I do kind of like this horse. There's nothing wrong with two horses. And the stables always have the best ones. Well, I guess you're right. This is going to be fun, Arthur. <coughs> I'm only... sorry. No, he's an angel. If I'm near him. Nasty little look in his eyes. Oh, don't be rude about this magnificent creature. Okay, see if you can get your leg over that brute. I know how to ride a horse. Easy, big fella. All right, let's head into town. No bar fights, please. I heard about that. I'll do my best. We're heading out. Might be gone a couple of days. They got a good range of horse tack at the Valentine stables. Some beautiful saddles. I used to have a real nice one. Yeah, what happened to that? Got stolen outside that saloon in Deer Creek. 
Ah, I remember now, just about. <laughs> that turned into a long day. Yes, remember? Mac went crazy, threatened to kill the whole town. <laughs> and Davy was passed out so cold we left him there, came back in the next day and he woke up, started right back drinking again. <laughs> Uh, I'll miss those boys. Jenny, too. She had some spot, that girl. It must be pretty hard on Lenny. You could tell he was sweet on her. Well, Lenny and Jenny could never have worked. That's like Arthur and Martha, or Bill and Phil. Oh. <laughs> yeah, maybe you're right. Does feel a bit like our luck died with them, too. Nonsense. We'll be all right. Just need some money to get back on our feet. I hope so. You found a way to offload those Cornwall bonds yet? Not yet. They're still very hot. Need to be done right. I have a couple of leads I'm looking into. Oh, we going off-roading. Don't let that big bastard get the better of you there, Arthur. Hey, he's all right. Morning. Stables are just up ahead. All right. All right. Go sell that big brute. Buy yourself a horse. Okay. I'm going to the money. general store. Get a few things to lure that bear out with. Meet you back here in a bit. Hey, how can I help you? I'm in the market for a new horse. Something strong and fast. Yeah, well, you're in the right place. I got some beauties in at the moment. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What about this one here? Yeah, are you looking to sell? I show sure, you. Yeah. You got papers? No. No papers. Well, of course, that's gonna affect what I can pay. But your luck's in. I got a fella who's been looking for a decent workhorse like this for a while. He'll pay a good price. Otherwise, I can always stable him here for you. Yeah, take a look. All right. Uh, the Shire. Heavy handling, speed, and acceleration. Goodbye. Is this a free horse? It is. Ooh, what should I name him? Hmm. Majesty. Nope, the keyboard don't work. I guess not. Bummer. Uh. Is that how you spell majesty? It is. Okay. I thought it had a G in it for a second. Majesty. All right. Tack and services, equipment, saddles. I don't know if this will actually do anything. Leather set. Oh, that is expensive. Let's stirrups.
fella came in, wanted to work at the shop. I let him try to bridle a colt, and he spooked that thing, and it tore around the damn stable, nearly like the... All right, partner. You got yourself a deal. And a fine new horse. I hope so. Well, I don't sell anything other than good animals. You have my word on that. Here are your papers, and on me, a new grooming brush, and some treats. <laughs> Appreciate it. Yeah. All right, you, you treat this fella well. I know he's gonna look after you just fine. Looks like a nice animal you got there. You happy? Guess we'll see. Hold it. Hey, 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 Up hey. up there, let's go. Don't run away from me. All right, let's get going. We got quite a ride ahead of us. Lead the way. So, what's this lake we're heading for? It's called O'Cray's Run, up in the mountains east of Cumberland Falls. I just hope I can remember how to get there. Back into the mountains? I sure didn't figure on that. But this time, we're doing the chasing. So, how are things with you and John? Fine. Ain't it about time you let it go now? It was a year, Jose. He ditched us for a goddamn year. I've spoken to him many times. He knows he did wrong. He just wants to put it behind him. I'm sure he does. Running off on that kid is one thing, but there's code. He knows that. He ain't Trelawney. Dutch and you pretty much raised him. I know. But it's done. Has been for a while now. <sighs> Nobody else would have been welcomed back that easy after that long. And you know it. Maybe. But please don't you put that to the test. Uh, <laughs> I never would. Beautiful game, still. Okay, I think we need to head right up here. Oh, this hand sanitizer smells reeks of alcohol. It's like nasty yes. vodka on my hand. I remember hand. this place, Moonstone Pond. We're going the right way. We made it. Let's loop around the other side. Maybe we should catch one to cook. Sure. Try and shoot one. You don't want to use anything too powerful on a small animal like that. Just ruin the meat. Best thing's a bow or a 22 caliber varmint rifle. I have hunted rabbits before, you know. Yes. And obliterated them with a shotgun, if I remember right. All right. You don't have to be that mean.
Good job. All right. It's getting late. Reckon we should camp here. Sure. Well, then you get us set up. Yeah, I'll get set up. Just, uh... Oh, I'm famished. Cook that rabbit, then. They're delicious on an open fire like this. Fine by me. <gasps> oh, <there's... clears throat> Just stick the meat right on top of the knife. You want some of this? No, I'm fine. I don't like eating this late. Okay. <laughs> After all that. <sighs> all right. Well, we better get some rest. I want to be up at first light to find this monster. He better be worth all this drama. Oh, I can't wait for the weather to be better so that I can go camping, sleep underneath the <clears throat> open sky. Morning, Arthur. <clears throat> you ready? No, oh, give me a minute. Coffee? Sure. Definitely. There you go. <sighs> so... What's your plan? Well, we'll see if we can track him, but we might need to lay bait to draw him out. Bears like fish, obviously, but they also have a sweet tooth. A lot of fellas bait, then shoot from the trees, but I prefer to hunt on the ground. More dangerous. But we'll have a much better chance of getting good shot in. And if he bolts, we can start right off after him. Can you mix up this bait for me while I finish packing this up? Fish, berries. Tie it up in that rag when you're done. I hope you know what you're talking about. I grew up in... Arthur. I was virtually weaned on bear meat. Okay. I think I got this done. Good. Pack up and we'll get going. What's the whole... Okay. Let's go. We'll try our luck down by the water. That's where I saw him last. Okay. How's that horse treating you? So far, so good. You know, I was in this area with Bessie years ago. Really? I didn't know that. I imagine you still miss her. Every day. Did you two ever think about getting out of the lot? No, we did briefly. You don't remember? Guess you were still young. <coughs> didn't last long. I drifted back into it. She understood. She knew what I was. I remember you not being around for a while, but well, things were looser back then. Truth is, there's never really any getting out. And staying in, it's hard. You know that. But Bessie and I made it work. Why? You thinking about getting out? Me? No, of course not. Listen, if Dutch's grand plans work, and we can make enough money to go someplace new, really new, maybe we can all have a new start. Anyway, for now, let's try and chase ourselves a bear, shall we? 
Let's slip by the water here, see if he's been fishing again recently. Look for tracks, dung, bones, any sign of him. Well, there's some paw marks here, Jose. They sure look big enough. Good. Let's hope it's him. Can you tell which way he went? This way. Tracks go into those trees. I should have gotten my rifle. fish here. Must have been left by our friend, I reckon. Come on, see if there's anything else. Something else on the ground, just here. There she is here. Watch your scalp. Looks real fresh. Reckon he's got to be close. Let's keep going. Um. Damn it. Looks like the trail ends here. <laughs> we lost him? For now. A little optimism, Arthur. Well, what do you think? I think we split up in each look. Either that or we could place bait here. That could work. Which do you think? Let's bait here. <coughs> Fine by me. Let's leave the bag over there. By those boulders up ahead, looks like a good spot for it. Say? More or less. Big scar down his face. Hey, did that bait look okay to you? I think so. You're the expert. Ready with your gun there? I'm good. You okay? You seem nervous. So do you. I'm fine. Let's just take a look at that bait. Sure. Come on. We only just said it, Jose. I know, but we need to do this right. We had you. Got your knife? Shit. Easy. No, it's too close.
Yeah, motherfucker. Nope. Oh. I was supposed to go to Hosea. Alright, I'll be right back. All right, just had a quick lunch break with my father. Uh... Let's just take a look at that bait. Sure. Come on. We only just said it, Jose. I know, but we need to do this right. Give me a hand here. Got your knife? Shit. Easy. No, it's too close. You're fine, old man. Of course I'm fine. It's, it's nothing. Ugh. Nothing at all. <gasps> Thank you. I think. <laughs> that was fun. <sighs> you know what, Arthur Morgan? I'm a little old and beaten up to be after the biggest game. You can have this. What is it? It's a map. A man in a bar gave it to me. Well, I stole it from him, but that's another story. <laughs> He said it, it told him where to find some real big animals. Thank you. It's a pleasure. You saved my life, Arthur. <laughs> I think I'm going back to camp to lick my wounds. <laughs> you coming or you gonna track that monster? Well... I'm gonna stick around <laughs> here for a while. <laughs> uh, I'll see you back at camp. Yeah! Let's go hunting some. All right, boy. We got a trail. Don't seem close. Okay, where are you? Um,
Oh. Firstly, pick up my hat. I wonder if there was a cleaner way of killing that bear. Oh, man. Anything from the bear that I can pick up? No? Alright. Okay, girl. Alright. Oh man, that was I was a bit fierce. Yeah, I think you can only bring the legendary skins. Whoa, okay. I'm not gonna ask questions, I'm just gonna run yep. far away. But I think the legendary you can only bring to trappers. And they'll make you an alpha. sir. First time here, I think. <coughs> oh, sir. Uh... Okay, let's take a look at it. Oh, I'd pay just about any price for this.
I pressed the wrong button. Yeah. I pressed the wrong button. Oh, man. I wasn't meant to. Idiot. I, uh... Oh my god. I did not mean to kill that trapper. Drop frames. <laughs> Easy. Oh man. Let me see if I got a wanted level because of that. I don't think so. Damn oh. you! Leave this property at once! I'm sorry. Wrong way. How's it going? Liberty is worth every penny. Okay, no bounty. I don't want to buy a train ticket. Well, yet. whatever. here and starved or eaten oh you poor dumb animal oh what'll i tell mildred what? you need a ride home ma'am oh oh yes mister please thank you do you know valentine i live there no problem come on Mr. Yep. <laughs> you know, good guy Arthur just gotta save ladies in distress. 
I don't normally travel this far alone, you know. I was off inquiring about a possible new line of work. I I'd borrowed a friend's horse for the trip. See, my husband, well, it's just me and my boy now, and it's hard to find work. Hmm, I'm sure it is. A good opportunity. That's what I'm looking for. Not much work for a woman with a boy to raise. I won't work in no saloon, but I've got sharp eyes and quick hands. I was hoping to get a job working as a seamstress. A wealthy man said he'd pay me for the work. Yeah, sounds promising. Also doesn't sound real. Oh, you may be right, I suppose. He said he'd provide room and board for me and for my child. He wanted to meet me first. I'd be careful with offers like that, ma'am. I can't afford to dismiss offers like these, even if they do seem... odd. Just be careful is all I'm saying. I may not have another opportunity like this. And now I'll have to pay Mildred back for her horse. It sure sounds like you're in a hard position. You finding me is the only good thing that's happened to me in a long while, sir. now. Just a little further. The hell's your problem? We're here. Thank you for all your help. You're a good man. Glad I was able to help. You take care. Appreciate it. You be well. Well, we're not too bad. So my horse Hello. is dirty. Where'd you get that tower? Good work, girl. Hello. Let's study her. Uh, brush. Oh, you a dirty girl. Or a dirty boy. Speak of the devil and you just shit right next to me. You dirty, dirty. Easy, girl. Hello. Uh, let me quickly go to the armory. Or the blacksmith, or whatever you call it. Whoop. Greetings. Oh, wait. You're that fellow who had to fight with Tommy outside of Smithfields? <sighs> yep. People are still talking about that fight. I ain't. Yeah, fair enough. Neither's Tommy. Anyway, how can I help you today? I just want to see what you guys have. Revolvers. Uh, I already have the cattle man. Oh, volcanic. How come I can't? I'll buy a free gun. Uh, let's just. Ooh, the Mauser. 
I'll buy the varmint and rifle. Thank you. Give me that 22. Any other free stuff that you want to give me? Thank you. I got three free guns. Um. Okay. So there's high velocity revolver cartridges. Regular revolver. Mm. Providing incredible stopping power contains 60 cartridges. High velocity that improves range damage, target penetration. Buy a few of that. Got him. Hey, partner. Partner? Just about ready to quit. Let's never mind. Looking, hey. Worth a shot. Style. Metals. You want to make oh. this really yours? Give it a personal engraving. Bet that piece could use a personal touch now that you've had it for some time. You know what? Bet you you could use some rifling on this thing. You'll be very pleased with this. Sights. Essential, I reckon. Got that. And the rifle. Good. Ain't no trace of rust on that as far as I can see. I got some nice carved stocks here. I think you should take one. It doesn't hurt to stock up on ammo. You never know. Oh, go with the express rounds. Varmint rifle component. Beautiful condition. Arrow, Keep it up. Rifling. You know what? I bet I can make this piece work a lot better for you. Bolts, triggers, parts, back here. That's it. 
All the trouble in Valentine of late, and people are starting to talk about the curse again. It's only a five dollar upgrade. Length. And give me accurate shotgun fire, which I don't know what that means. Alright. See ya. Maybe I already done my fair share. You ain't scared nobody. Careful. They finally broke that Mustang up at Denny's. Taking them months. Well, I'll be dressed. Here it is, folks. All the news you need. Partner. Want to buy a paper? Next time. Let's go, girl. Actually, before that, let's go to... How does it? <laughs> let's go to Reverend Swanson. Put you in your grave. You dead now? Ah! There I was. Don't. I ain't worth it. This is uh, you very son of a bitch. kind of you. Fucking asshole.
got you got to kill these animals Call it a day there, girl. in a certain way girl. to keep that three star skin. Yeah. Actually, since I'm nearby the camp. It's me. Look what the cat dragged in. You been bringing in money? Of course I have. Okay, well, good. Sure, Morgan. <laughs> yeah. Firstly, no cat's gonna drag me, okay? A dog, maybe, but not a cat. Hey, Arthur. This cat, all good? Too good. I'd like the chance to shoot a fella and not feel bad about it. Somehow that doesn't surprise me. <laughs> Stay alert. Evening, Arthur. Mr. Pearson. Evening, Mr. Morgan. Evening. So, how are you? Mm. I apologize in advance for this stew. It needs better meat. Well, good. We really needed this. Many thanks, Mr. Morgan. <laughs> hey, Arthur. What you want? Man, you want that? Only when I see you. Only when I see you. Hello. What's wrong? Thought you'd be happy to be off that mountain. No, oh, I don't know. You ain't been yourself for a while. What's to be done, Miss Gaskell? Mm. Let's get a full day's rest, baby, because that's. I need. I slept for like nine hours. Yeah, over the night felt great. New journal entry. Okay. Rambling through the woods plane? Oh, I guess I'll keep that. Um, Good morning, Arthur. Morning. How you feel? Stronger for sure. But not strong enough to work. Ooh, that was that was a bit of a low blow, Arthur. Let's go, cool, girl. What the hell is wrong with me? Oh, God. I don't think you should just be wandering around here, friend. Not a thing happens around here without an O'Driscoll saying so. No need Other for threats. I ain't close. Keep going!
What's the hold up? Play your damn hand. Play it. Right. Hey, you better start acting right around here. Mr. Morgan, I took your advice, sir. I took your advice. Then your god has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I took your advice, sir. I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. No more shall I sink, sir. I am free. I am free. You don't seem free, friend. You seem drunk. Sit down, Reverend. We ain't finished. You ain't finished. Look at him, he's finished. None of us forced liquor down his throat. Friend, I just want him to play. Now, firstly, we ain't friends. Don't make no mistake on that subject. Now, secondly, he can't hardly see, let alone reason. Now, reasoning ain't never been one of my strong points, neither. But see, and I do just fine. You want to step outside or deal with business here? I just want him to finish the game. Why can't we all just get along? These are good men, Arthur. They're children of God. They're children of God. How's about you playing this place, huh? That seems fair. Fair? Sure. You want a game? <sighs> sure. I'll play a few hands. Well, sit yourself down then. I'm Luther. This is Marvin. Fortunate for you both, we're being gentlemen about this. Same goes for you. So, how you two know each other anyway? Don't seem like the likeliest of friends, if you don't mind me saying. We go a long way back. And now you're his chaperone? I guess it's something like that. Can we play? There we go. He can't be no real clergyman. <laughs> he committed about five cardinal sins just in that chair you're sitting in. I think he used to be. He's drifted a little in recent years. Uh, life is a challenge to all of us. All Can you imagine baby. him at the pulpit? If he could stand up. On the fourth day, he turned water into whiskey, and I don't remember much after that. <laughs> <laughs> I check. He's a decent fella going through a bad time. Disrespect him again and you'll find yourself in a bad time too. All right, all right. Just trying to have a little fun here. It is a game after all, mister. Have a look at these. The same what you call finishing strong. Big pile of nothing. Come on! For Christ's sake! <laughs> Come on! Mm. Ain't this a fine old time? The best. I must say, you have a lot less stories than your friend did. Oh, God, what type of hand did I get? Uh, sure. I'll, I'll check. Not for me. Check. Uh... Nah. You're a pretty dull player. Come on. At least make it interesting. Here. And I guess we are really playing. Good. Not for me. You should just go play checkers the amount you check. Relax, take it easy. All right, what do we got? Her face is uh, <laughs> pretty pathetic. Aw, oh, damn. Ah, all right.
All right, one or two more hands, and then that's it. Let's Are go. you kidding me? Okay. I'm a play slow. Jesus, you play like my grandmother. Okay then. I reckon you're full of shit. Ah, well. Let's start this low for now. Oh, come on. This ain't kid poker. All I'm in. Go all in. Shit. Ah. Mm-hmm. Yes. Shit, that's the way it goes. Will you button it? I wonder if there's a Wish I'd got your friend to bless my there. hand before he passed out. Huh. That's it. I mean, I don't have the best of hands. Let's bet a dollar, boys. Make this a little bit more faster no, and interesting. Don't get too worried. Okay, let's do this. No, not for me. Damn it. Uh, what do I have? Uh. How about that? Uh, I reckon all in. You're bluffing. There. What? I don't believe it. I wish I had your hand. Come on! I really need some better cards. <laughs> now that's what I'm talking about. You won the pot of kicker. You lucky son of a bitch. Don't get scared. Hey, easy there, tiger. Fold. Damn it. God damn it. Don't don't lose like that. That's what I got. Oh shit. Things are looking okay. Yep. This is getting too easy. That's some run of luck. <clears throat> oh, okay. Not a bad hand, but could be better. Let's make it interesting. Hellfire. You I'll really call. that though? Screw it. Okay, let's do this. All in. Five, six, five, six, seven, eight. I need a nine or a four. Yes. Let's see then. Oh, that's a miracle. 
Let's go. Mm. Well, gentlemen, time to move along. Aw, oh, hell. You're one lucky son of a bitch, you know that? Oh, I'm surely a son of a bitch, but lucky? <laughs> I ain't so sure. Come on, you. Let's move along. Where is he? Who? The Reverend. Where'd he go? I don't know. Ah, oh, shit. Excuse me, gentlemen. Reverend! Reverend Swanson! Where'd you go? Come on, my girl. You crazy? Yep. Hey! Reverend! Mr. Morgan! Get your hands off him! I didn't say a word! You'll keep! You stay out of it! Get your hands off him now, you son of a bitch! Jesus. This guy's Usain Bolt. I said stop, damn it. Okay, okay. Please, don't hurt me. Do I have to run after him? Good lord. Hey, you! Get back here! Ah, oh, shit. I said stop, damn it! Okay, okay. Please, don't hurt me. You tell anyone what you saw back there? You're a dead man. You understand me? Yep. I I won't tell a soul. I promise. Good. Get the hell out of here. It's the last thing I needed. You're a dead man. You understand me? Yep. I I won't tell a soul. I promise. Good. Get the hell out of here. It's the last thing I needed.
what is going on with this mission. Oh my god! Killed him! I'm gonna keep the law on you! Hey you! Get back here! You better stop right there! Stay away from me! I said stop, damn it! Okay, okay. Please don't hurt me. What you saw? Follow the family! Forget about it. I'll find you. Good. Get the hell out of here. This place and wants to stay. <coughs> Get your foot out of here. Twist your leg, you drunken bastard. Got it. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> You. What the hell is wrong with you? Throwing me off a bridge like there that? There was a goddamn train, you crazy bastard! <sighs> Have I been bad again, Mr. Morgan? I'm sorry. Uh, I wish I was different. <laughs> Let's get you home. Home? Yeah, that's a wonderful idea. I could have tea with Margaret. Margaret? Who's Margaret? But... <sighs> Drunken old bastard. <sighs> yep. Ass mission. On Majesty. Close the drapes. Yeah. when he'd show up.
You better sleep your way to <laughs> salvation, my friend. <laughs> what happened? Just the usual. Poor <laughs> bastard. Exactly. Well, thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'll keep an eye on him. He was lucky this time. Real lucky. <laughs> Mr. Strauss? Herr Morgan! Herr Morgan! Mr. Strauss? You busy, my friend? Why? I'll cut you in. Loan it. Already? You know how it is. People is happy to borrow off someone like me, but more enthusiastic paying back to someone like you. Of course. Who are they? Hmm, let me see. A Chick Matthews works at Guthrie Farm. He's a hand, I believe. Mr. Robel, the small holder at Painted Sky, runs the operations there, badly. Miss Lily Millet is a ranch maid up at Emerald Ranch. And here was me believing Dutch's bluster about us helping folk. It's legal work, Mr. Morgan. Debtors belong in prison. We are doing them a favor. Right. I'll make sure they see it in them terms. Put the debts in the deed box and try not to kill them. It's very bad for business. I just miss him so much. Of course you do. Goes without saying. Uh, what am I going to do? You're going to suffer. <laughs> and life's going to go on. That's the truth of it. I, I won't lie to you. Oh, Miss Roberts. I know. I know that. Where, where am I going to go? Stay here with us. <laughs> Folk, they ain't so bad. It's nasty out there on your own. I know. You'll be safe here. <laughs> All right. So there's one literally across the river. At least for now. So you like the new camp, Jack? Sure. It's fine. It'll do us for now. Okay, Mr. Morgan. I don't think I got anything to contribute. How's it going? Oh, item. Yeah, I don't got nothing. Hey, Arthur. Hey. So that feller who was hashling you in Valentine. I'll tell you another time, okay? Okay, sure. Okay, I'll catch you later then. Sure, Arthur. Mm. Where's my horse? Mr. Morgan. You seem chipper. Yeah. I needed this. partner come take a look at this look at this my friend tobacco nature's gift to us all hmm. focuses the mind like nothing else whatever you say 
Well, I say, why buy it off the shelves when you can make your own? Well, plenty left here if you're interested. I'd best keep moving. This guy just ate raw tobacco. <laughs> Looks like a good one. Knock, knock, Mr. Robe. No, przepraszam, co pan robi w moim domu? God damn it. English? Uh, you me, speak English? Me? Uh, um, Silesia. Yeah, good uh, for you. Silesia. I'm here for money. You borrow from a German man? Ah, uh, German. Uh, um, mein Herr, uh, uh, sprechen das, uh, this, uh, uh, the no, Kaiserreich. I don't yeah? speak German neither. I'm here for money. Money that you borrowed from Leopold Strauss. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, Leopold Strauss. Uh huh. Yeah. So it's time to pay. Where is it? Oh, well, no, I have nothing. It's very bad winter. We've all had a bad winter, pal. Where is it? No. Now, you remember where you're keeping that silver? Potrzebuję trochę czasu. Znajdę ci pieniądze. No, still don't understand you. Where is the money? Gold, dollars. Nie rób tego. I have nothing. Przestań. Nie, nie. Już nie mam siły. Ah, no, 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 no. Please, no. I don't have money, but, but I have this. It's, it's good. It's good. It's valuable. It's, it's Warszawa, yes. I have your things, okay? I have anything in here or out there. Don't even speak English. Literally nothing. Better be something somewhere. It's very valuable, good. Not good yet. about cover things. I'll take the oil.
Yep. Alright, who's the next one? God, this horse has a lot of stamina. Can't loot any of these guys. No, oh, there was an option. There we go. Ooh. This guy had quite a lot of money. with this guy. Hey! 
Need a hand with your horse? <laughs> Shit. Yeah. Why are you running away from me? Yep. Oh. You chick Matthews. Oh, no, no, not me, sir. Uh-uh, that's the greenhorn over there. Oh, and there he goes. So long, long shark. <laughs> Damn it! Hey! Get back here! You owe us money! Da -da. Whoa, whoa! The more I chase, the more you owe! Taking your teeth as well. Come on, this ain't right. Blow me down. Aren't you gonna untie me? You got the map. Do the decent thing. You'll find it there. Everything. I promise. 
You idiot. If I'm honest. Really? For the most part. Yeah. Now I gotta go hunting for the money. <laughs> Something about it being hidden. Come on, girl. All right. That's not going to happen up there. Why it always got to be such a goddamn performance with you? Now, I told you I'd get you the money next week, and I'll get it. If you didn't make it this week, who's to say you'll make it next? Don't you take that tone with me. I thought you said you loved I me. I do. I do. But what I get paid ain't enough for one person, let alone two. Your money's got to be your problem now. The only problem I got is this bleating going on in my ear. Now, lay off it, Lily. God damn it. Lily, where's our money? What? That loan you took. It's payday. It is payday. I'm sorry. I don't have it right now. Well, then. I guess we got a big problem, don't we? Cooper, give him what you've got. I ain't giving him nothing except a lesson in damn money. Son of a bitch. Just give him the money, Cooper. <laughs> Money, leave me alone. Hey, you know what I do to What lose? do you want? Law here about this. I've got nothing to I say. I didn't to steal you. that. It's a debt. Oh, damn it. Ain't my concern, no sir. Yeah. Yeah.
I'll say fuck off bounty hunters. Who's there? Unless you're dog the bounty hunter. Yeah. Now the leisure comes into play. Um, so, how are you? Happy as a clam in high water. Good for you. Oh, hey, Dutch. Hmm. Interesting how Dutch's upgrade is. How did you get on, Herr Morgan? Fine. Our accounts are up to date. Side sacks, a lot of them. Good, very good. My pleasure. Uh, well, if it's pleasure you're after, there is one other. This farmer preacher fellow I met in Valentine, Mr. Downs. The opinionated little do-gooder? Yeah, I know the one. I certainly know the type. Thank you, Herr Morgan. There's no need to thank me. Like you said, it's pleasure I'm after. He's more slippery than he seems. I've tried being polite. Don't take any nonsense. Nonsense? Me? If he doesn't have the money, beat him. Well, I usually do. I know. I know. Put in a good word, would you? Oh. What other missions do I have? I have Kyrian. I have Strauss's mission over there. Oh. Okay. To Kyrian's mission. Speak! Don't cry, boy. Speak! About your gang! <laughs> <laughs> I can't. <laughs> Boy. Whoa, hold your horses there. It seems the uh, cat has got our friend here's tongue. I was thinking Mr. Williamson could have a word. You ready to talk, boy? <laughs> I told you, mister. I told all of you. I don't know nothing, okay? They ain't no friends of mine. I've just been ridden with them for a Horse while. Horseshit. You see, we heard that part, so how about you tell the truth? That's what you want me to do. Hurt him, so the next time he opens his mouth, it is to tell us what is going on! Ah. <laughs> Who am I kidding? One of O'Driscoll's boys couldn't open his mouth, but he'd tell a lie. Screw it. Let's just have some fun. Huh? Geld him. Oh, yeah! <laughs> What's he doing? Where's he going? Oh, don't worry. You're only balls, boy. 
<laughs> just gonna cause you trouble. <laughs> you know, in Imperial Rome, Unix was among the happiest and most loyal of courtiers. Oh, no, you're kidding me, right? <laughs> of course. You sick bastards! So, what do you want from me? Well, you are gonna talk. The only question is now or after we got these little fellas off. Okay, okay, listen. I know where old Driscoll was holed up, and you're right. He don't like you any more than you like him. He's at Six Point Cabin. Uh, I'll take you there. <coughs> Serious, I don't like him. I mean, I like him even less than I like you. No offense. Oh, none taken. <laughs> okay, then, partner. Uh, Why don't you take a few of us up there right now? I got this, Dutch. Should be fun. All right, you. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> Killed him. <laughs> Let's both hope you ain't trying to trick us, O'Driscoll. I ain't no O'Driscoll. Are you sure as shit was? John, Phil, come here. We got a social call needs making. Where are we heading? Uh, we're up into the hills behind Valentine. Uh, I'll show you. John, you take this little rattlesnake with you. Any nonsense, kill him. Sure. You gotta pay your buddies our respects. He taking us to cold? That's what he says. Come on. I'm taking you to him. Look, I I'll give you more directions when we're close. But if I know where we are, it's up past Valentine. All right, I'll leave. Jesus, I just got news. 400,000 people have died in COVID. That is good Jared Lord Almighty. Shared saddle with an old Driscoll. Who'd have thought? How many times I gotta say? I ain't an old Driscoll. You sure look like one, and you smell like... God damn. You smell like one, too. I smell like horse shit. That's right. Boy, are you high. Morgan, you got throwing knives in your saddlebag. Dud said that you might... I was asked to give them, and I'm doing you the further courtesy of telling you about it. Next time you want to give me something, how about you give it to me, instead of hiding it somewhere, hoping the opportunity comes up to mention it? Last goddamn favor I do you. Hey, hey, if, if I got my bearings, it's over here. Yeah, I know this country. Take this track up through the rocks. How you holding up, John? Fine. Still ain't right, but I'm fine. You damn well should be after all that bed rest. Hey, all right. Abigail wouldn't let me up. You know her. She won't be reasoned with. Well, when you was having a failure of reason and hiding behind your woman, we were getting shot at. And I'd do the same for you if you was in a bad way. I hope so. But I fear you don't know how to help anyone. Except in yourself. You see, old Driscoll? If this is how he treats his friends, imagine what he does to his enemies. I got an inkling of what y'all do to your enemies when you put those gelding tongs to my parts. Bill, you still got those tongs? I got a knife. Won't be so clean, but it'll do the job. <laughs> now we go left, the uh, road will take us up and round. Save your horses, we gotta climb, boys. You know, you all ain't that different from the old Driscolls. What did you just say? I've been watching you all these weeks, and uh... You've been tied to a tree. You don't know nothing about this gang. Yeah, well, I'd, I'd say you don't know much about the old Driscolls. But maybe I know more about you than you know about them. And I know all about them, so... <laughs> Tell us then, how are we like those mongrel dogs? You're outlawed like them. You're out to survive like them. You live rough. You live hard. Fighting the law, nature. You're out for yourselves. See, this is why you're an O'Driscoll, O'Driscoll. You're out to survive. We're out to live, free. Colm's a sneak thief and a killer. 
Dutch is... Dutch is more like a teacher. From where I've been, you just look the same as all. Then you looked, but you ain't seen. John, shut that boy up. Enough out of you. Boss, we're almost on them. Now, who knows if this son of a bitch we got with us is talking true, but if it's what he says it is, and Colm O'Driscoll's here, we can end years of fighting. Here and now. Okay, now, now cut left up here. We, we go down the hill into the forest. We're going Sounds like in that quiet, redneck. Taking them out GTA. as we find them. Trying not to set things off. But if we do, we move quick and hard. We settle this like we know how, okay? Okay by me. With you, Morgan. All right, then. Through the trees here. is the other side of this clearing. I'll get my guns off my horse, and I'm ready. Easy, Bill. Quiet. This is it. The cabin's just the other side of this hill. Okay. Off your horses. Let's go. You gonna get them knives? I said easy. Uh, Follow me, all right? It ain't far. We might have shared the horse, but we ain't friends. Remember, I'm watching you every moment. I ain't gonna shop you now, come on. It'd be suicide. You'll die, boy. But you'll lose your balls first. Jesus Christ. Just over the ridge. Okay, get down. The cabin's in the clearing down there. There'll be a bunch of fellers hiding out there, too. Are these fellas armed? Armed? Drunk? Wary of strangers, yep. And Colm O'Driscoll? Uh, he'll be holed up in his cabin. Be passed out, booze blind, likely as not. Hey, over there. Someone's coming. So, uh, who's gonna tell him we ain't got nothing for the pot? Oh, let me think. The feller that spooked the game, I reckon. I'm gonna drain it. I I'll catch up. No, we ain't gonna fall for that. We're gonna wait so you can tell them yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone's actually gonna shoot the messenger, it'd be that mean son of a bitch. Mm -hmm, yes, yeah, sir. Come on, shake it off. Come on. What are we doing about the pisser, Morgan? One by the tree. He's yours, Williamson. Okay. I got him. where they won't hear us. When I move, you move. Take them out at a distance. I can do that. God damn. Good work. We're moving on the camp. I left our guide up there. He's meek as a little lamb. He better be. Over here. Feller on the log. What are we doing about him? Take him quiet, Marston. Okay. Get your hands dirty for a change. Jesus. 
Okay, now what? We're at the perimeter. Time to move on them. You ready? As I'll ever be. Let's go. How you doing, old Driscoll? Right in the can. Check. You look out here. What? You set us up. No, I didn't. You did. Come on, Driscoll ain't here. He was here, I swear. I, sw I mean, if I was setting you up, I, I wouldn't have <laughs> saved your life. It's a good point, Arthur. All right, then, go on. Get out of here. Hey? I won't kill you. No, I didn't set you up. You lost. Shit, lost. I'm letting you run away. Now, go on. Get out of here. That's as good as killing me. Out there, without you, Como just was going to lose his mind about this. So? So I'm one of you now. <sighs> Give me a break. All right, then. But I'm warning you. Oh, hey, I know. Come on, let's get to camp. So you got the cash, then? What cash? Yeah, there's usually some cash. In the chimney. I'll check it. Rest of you boys, get to camp, quick. See, Arthur? Yeah, I ain't so bad. <laughs> hey, Bill. You tell Dutch old Karen ain't worth killing. Just yet. <laughs> Right you are. Uh, okay, so let's loot. <coughs> Did 
Just money on the floor. Okay. Uh, search the drawer. Nothing in there. Uh, I got enough shotgun shells. Money clip. Another money clip. Another money clip. Ooh. It's a lot of money clips. Oh, biscuits. Gotta take that. I see a Kentucky bourbon. Kentucky bourbon? Oh no, I can't take any. Whoop, wrong button. Guess I'll just have to drink this bourbon I got. Okay. No, no, I want the shotgun. Right stick to maintain. Oh, it was a rusted piece of shit. At least you got something tucked away. Six hundred dollars. So there's a Dutch mission, Javier mission down there. What is this Dutch mission? Find out.
the dead body over there. We're not going to examine that. Arthur! I was just with you, bro. Contribute. Oh, why'd you stop the music? That was awesome. Uh, Arthur wants a map to help plan journeys. I mean, that's not bad. Um, but... Let's get that. I went to all city for her street and all While all my world traveling and roaming around I spied a fair maiden so lovely. Gently, I heard I did say she pulled up her Got the medical. So scared it would soar. I out with old Phoenix <coughs> went boring for oil. I hadn't been boring six inches or more. The oil from my auger so freely did pour. She wiggled her ass. Looked up and smiled, said, Wiggling her ass. Your auger, for I know you struck all. Things went on and on for a week or ten uh, days. My auger machinery got to fire in some ways. Oh. Well, now. <laughs> okay, that's not bad. Can't go wrong with that one. Right. Uh, throwing knives, shotguns, rifle ammo. I don't think I need that right now. Right now. Cocaine, chewy gums, and assorted sweets. Potent health cures and tonics. Mm. 
Arthur. Dutch, Miss O'Shea. Well, feels like we are finally getting back on our feet. You uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole? Not yet, but Jose is working on it. When we heading west? Soon? I don't know. Feels like things have changed. The whole world's changed. But they don't want folk like us no more. We're being hunted. We are smarter than them. Only the feeblest of men take jobs in the government. <laughs> I hope so. Trust Dutch, Mr. Morgan. You have to. They got Micah! Dutch! Arthur! <laughs> What's going on? They got Micah. He, he's been arrested for murder. He was in Strawberry It's okay, and... son. Breathe. They nearly lynched me. They, they got Micah and the sheriffs in Strawberry. And there's talk of hanging them. Here's open. Here's what? open. What? What? The fool brought this on himself. You know my feelings about him, Dutch. You think I can't see past his bluster to the heart inside? He is a fine man. No, I ain't saving that fool. I can't go. My face will be all over West Elizabeth. I am asking. He would do it for you. I don't okay. think he would, but fine, all right. Arthur. You okay, Lenny? Yeah, of course I'm okay. You don't seem okay. You take that kid into town. Valentine, not Strawberry. Get him drunk. And Arthur, no crazy business. I've given that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. Come on, son. I'll get to it, Dutch. Just can't drop everything. Yeah. I rode as fast as I could. Didn't stop for nothing. Yeah, you look like you've been through it. I'm beat. We finally get off that mountain, then this. Micah's got a crazy side off him. What were you boys doing? You're supposed to be scouting ahead for us. I kept asking him what we was doing, but he was, you worry too much, kid. Just, just some business to attend to, kid. You know how he is. Yes, I do. He was half soaked before we even got there. Then we ran into some fellas. One of them, Micah knew, drank some more. And this is supposed to be a dry town we're in, too. And then he shoots one of them. I know how that goes. Couldn't even tell you quite how. It happened like the strike of a match. The law was on us fast, too. They was ready to strangle me up there and then. But I got away, just about. You're all right now. Uh, we'll take care of it. So you're going to go get them? I'll come with you. No, you leave it to me. For now, let's drink some. Forget about Mike. It was drank that started all this. We'll just have a couple. Settle you down and head back, okay? Okay. Now, I should warn you. Me and a couple of the other boys, we got in a bit of a fight last time we was here. What kind of fight? Here we are. Is this the mission? Just one or two, right off of? Of course, just a drink. No big job. Can we get a couple beers, please? You, I don't want no trouble. And you'll get none from me. I was defending myself. Tommy, he's... He'll be fine. Here, have one for yourself. Thank you. <laughs> mm. Micah seemed to know a lot of people. That was the problem. How you mean? I mean, I done seen a lot of crazy, crazy I stuff, but Micah... A lot Micah... of crazy, crazy stuff. Will you shut up? Will you shut up? Be quiet, buddy. <laughs> oh, they're dullards. My lord. You men is dull. 
<laughs> hey, leave this fool alone. Leave the fool alone. People been leaving me alone for the last. Listen, buddy. You're a charming fellow. One of the best. But me and the kid here, we're trying to talk business, so could you possibly leave us alone? No offense intended. Ain't no pleasing some folk. Just trying to be friendly. <laughs> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> That's great, Martin. Lenny, Lenny, where are you? Hey, you see my friend anywhere? Yeah, I can't say, I'm afraid. Lenny? Lenny, where are you? Lenny! Seen that fella I was with? No, sorry. Hey, Lenny! Can't find my friend. You know where we went? No idea. You know which way my friend went? Afraid I don't know. your mouth, mister. Cheers. Cheers. No, 
for drunken violence in this town. You're just lucky no one was killed. Hey, we didn't start a thing. <laughs> yes, you did. Well, I don't remember. <laughs> Either you fools got any money, it's $10 and you're free to walk. Sure. Now, get out of here. I don't want to see either you around here no more. So, that was a quiet drink? First one was pretty quiet. <laughs> yeah, the first one was pretty quiet. At least it took your mind off a goddamn mic. Well, that's certainly true. I gotta get out of here. I'm just gonna have a little sit down and feel sorry for myself. I'm gonna save. Alright, that's gonna be the end of today's stream. Thank you for watching. I will be back hopefully tomorrow. It's four hours in. Alright.